Okay, getting right to it. Can you believe how far we are? We're all the way into the peach colored squares. And so the workout and the orange squares goes to three sets of 10 repetitions. I'm gonna add the stability ball and the small weighted ball into the workout today. But those are options. You can stay on the floor and do them just the way we've been doing them, okay? Uh, also, I'm not gonna do the squats on the video. The whole point of doing the squats at the chair sits is just to get some blood flowing so that you're ready to work. So before you do your abs from now on, do some kind of activity, you know, a couple of sets of squats or whatever. You don't, Just what I had on the sheet is what I want you to do, something like that. All right, three sets of 10. We're beginning with the bicycle maneuver. Lay back. Go. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten.
trouble rolling up. You know, the modification is to use your pull up or use your elbows to push up. But check this out. You can put one leg in the air and let it help you. Maintain that strong, strong core while you're doing it. Of course, I've lost count again. So we'll call it 10. I need a volunteer to come and count the reps for me. Like Heather. Come and count, and then I won't be lost. Okay, last one, roll up. Every time 
number is where you count the rep, okay? All right, let's do that about the stability ball. Now your stability ball weighs about two to three pounds, so it is a pretty significant load that you're gonna carry. Okay, you're gonna catch it between your feet. Here we go. One. I mean, there's one. Two. Four, five, I almost dropped it, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then you just lay here and wait a second. Get this ability ball like between your ankles. If you've got shoes on, maybe your shoes will help you hang on to it. Okay, this last set. I'm gonna use this stability ball, but I'm gonna keep my legs a little bit bent. One, two, three. So the thing is, you try four. Try to maintain this position. Five. Well, all this other nonsense is going along. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. And ten. Y'all did good. I know you did good. Okay, let's see what's next. Push-ups. No, I'm just not kidding. Push-ups never get easy for me. I'm not, I'll probably never get up to straight legs this go round, but that's okay. Here we go. First set of 10. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one. You see what I mean? That if, if you look at my post on um, the Falling Fitness on Facebook today, the day I'm filming this, I put that post that a push-up is really a plank plus. It's, it's maintaining the plank position but then moving it. Second set, go. Ten. Nine. Eight. Try not to squint or grunt. Try to relax your face. Three, two, one. I'm not even kidding you. These are hard for me. Let me see what's next. Plank. Okay, third and final set of your push-up, plank plus. Get it! Yeah! Woo! 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 <laughs> Three, two, one. La! I think that was Michael Jackson in a former life. Right plank. Ready, set, go.
planks. They're getting rough. Are you glad I didn't do three? Yeah, just one side of the plank. Okay, here we go. Other side. Lift. Now this top arm, I'm just using to remind myself to stay perpendicular to the floor. You don't have to have it there. It can be doing anything. We can do some external rotation. Or not. Tight, tight, tight. Lift. Come on, y'all. Come on, come on, come on. 15 seconds remaining. We're almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Pull your dog. Now, this exercise is going to stay at 30 seconds, okay? We're going to get what we need in just 30 seconds on each side. Now, it won't hurt you if you want to do it longer than 30 seconds. It's not going to hurt anything. But I think we pretty much get what we need in 30 seconds. Change sides. Go. Keep that weight on your hand. Don't lock your elbow. Long leg, long arm. Lift in the core. Come on, come on, come on. Second hand. Go, second hand. Go. Three, two, one. All right. Press your hips back, arms out in front. I'm gonna reach over to one side. Reach over the other side, and while that arm is out there, I'm kind of pulling away with my hip. Optional, downward dog. Keep your hands about yay so, tuck your hips, or uh, tuck your toes under and lift your hips. This song's a little bit violent. Blood on the dance floor, are you kidding me? And then, stretch number three. Now, I'm gonna show you a super duper duper option. Just Think about it. You sit up tall, your hands are on the floor behind you. Look straight ahead, lift your hips, a reverse plank to stretch your shoulders. Just hold it down, just hold it for a second. Lay on your back, lie on your back. Okay. This is your third progression, three sets of 10. You nailed it. I'm really proud of you. 